Asus ROG Strix G15 AMD Advantage Edition Review Over the past few years, the best gaming laptops have been dominated by Intel and NVIDIA hardware, something that only started changing in 2020 when AMD released its Ryzen 4000 laptop processors. The Asus ROG Strix G15 is the next step in that direction, launched with not only Ryzen 5000 series processors but paired with the latest high-end Radeon graphics announced at Computex 2021. Honestly, there's a lot riding on the Asus ROG Strix G15 as it goes against the grain of the hardware we typically see in devices like this, especially in this price range. We're not sure yet how much the Asus ROG Strix G15 will cost when it hits the streets, but we have been told that it will cost around $1,650, about £1,160, £2,130. In terms of price, it's in between the Razer Blade and Asus own Zephyrus G14, both of which are some of the best gaming laptops available today. We recently reviewed the Asus ROG Zephyrus G15, which has a very similar configuration, with a Ryzen 9 5900HS and an RTX 3070 but with a slower 165Hz display for $1,499, £1,599, £2,599. Asus ROG Strix G15 is as traditional a gaming laptop as you'll find today, despite being on the nicer end of the gamer aesthetic spectrum. Gaming laptop, with a black color scheme and red accents, both at the back, as well as on the rubber foot that serves as a foot for the laptop when it's upside down. That rubber foot also has some text engraved on it that says back on top next to the Asus ROG logo. While it does have a dated design aesthetic, don't think that it's cheaply made. The top of the laptop and the keyboard deck are made of aluminum, and while the keyboard deck does have some give, you have to push down hard to make it bend. The RGB lighting in the keyboard can also be controlled via the Asus Armory Crate app, just like any other gaming laptop from Asus. There is also a huge trackpad on this laptop, more like what you would find on an XPS 15 than on one of these gaming laptops. What's more, the trackpad feels solid. A lot of gaming laptops will have squishy or wobbly clickers, but everything about this trackpad feels premium. It seems a waste in a laptop that most people will pair with one of the best gaming mice. However, we love it when we just want to do some light web browsing. In my opinion, one of the biggest weaknesses of this laptop is the placement of the speakers. Despite the fact that there is plenty of space both on the sides and above the keyboard, the speakers instead fire out the bottom. As long as you're using it on a table, the speakers themselves are fine. However, they lack bass, so if you're listening to music or playing a game with a lot of explosions, you'll probably want headphones. You'll still want to use a gaming headset when you're gaming anyways, since the fans on this laptop can get quite loud when pushed. There's definitely not enough to annoy everyone you live with, but they are definitely noticeable when under load. Fortunately, when you unplug the laptop, it immediately switches to silent mode, which drastically cuts performance, but makes it more tolerable to just sit and enjoy some content. The Asus ROG Strix G15 has plenty of ports to offer on the right side of the laptop. There are two USB ports and a combo 3.5mm audio jack. Most of the ports are hidden on the back of the laptop, exactly where we like to see them in a gaming laptop. You'll find another USB port, a USB-C Gen 3.2 port, HDMI, Ethernet, and a dedicated charging port. With an AMD Ryzen 9 5900HX processor, 16GB of RAM, and an AMD Radeon RX 6800M graphics card, the Asus ROG Strix G15 is an absolute powerhouse. AMD introduced the Radeon RX 6800 in a keynote that specifically targeted the GeForce RTX 3070, and the 6800M, well, it crushes it. In pretty much every benchmark we run, AMD's GPU outperforms NVIDIA's. In Metro Exodus, the Strix G15 passes the 73 FPS that the 3070 equipped Asus ROG Zephyrus G15 manages, with 78 FPS. That's just in our PC Mark 10 battery test which simulates real-world workloads in an office setting. The Asus ROG Strix G15 manages 11 hours, 23 minutes of battery life. It falls short in our video streaming test, where it manages just 9 hours, 22 minutes, but that's still a solid 8-hour day. It's no surprise that there is no webcam on the ROG Strix G15. If all you want is a laptop that lets you play the best PC games, this won't be a big deal.